Hey my YouTube subbies. This is Supremacy and I'm coming at you with a another subs recent subscriber appreciation video. I'm going to jump right into it. In my last video, Leopard is My Lover, I had advised you guys that I was going to be doing um, some special shout outs to the most recent subscribers um, until we kind of get where we need to be. So forgive me if I've forgotten anyone. I'm going to go ahead and start off by saying some of these subscribers, um, the names. Some of the names are a little bit more unique than others, a little bit more difficult than others. So forgive me if I make any mistakes in saying any names. Um, it is not intentional. And I am going to try my best to pronounce everybody's name correctly. So first and foremost, let me just say thank you to all of my um, subscribers that came before 100. We have just crossed the line. We're at about 110 at this point. And gotta be Jerry. I want to say hi. You were my 100th subscriber. So if you are watching uh, gotta be Jerry, I want to say thank you so very much for bringing us into um, the 100th. Okay. All right. So the next subscriber after was ISC1213. I want to say thank you. I'm going to move through these pretty fast because I've got some um, some, some ear earrings to show you all as well on this. Um, it is a shout out slash haul video. Okay. So my next subscriber, and I wrote them all down, guys, because I didn't want to leave anybody out. And of course, I can't remember them. My next subscriber was Primmy One Iffy. The next is Sexy Red Line, Red Bone TV, Demanda73. Thank you, Demanda. April Carthage, Beauty Black Queen, Miss Brit Brit1989, Soulful72, Donathan521. Miss Lexi Bear 0605. Hey, Miss Lexi. I know her personally, guys. Mwah. Thanks for coming over and being a great friend and subscribing. Uh, Mr. Biggs 43. Plus Pretty. Another one that I know personally, I like to thank so very much. Yummy Rich 515. Carmen 4519. And Lovely Vincy. Everyone that I just called, I want to send a big, big, big shout out to and say thank you so very much for contributing towards the channel. And I just want to welcome you guys. My um, older subscribers know we have a good time. We do check up from the neck up. We really get engaged and we're on our way up. So I want to thank everybody. Okay. So let's just jump into what I'm wearing um, very quickly here because I know... Um, I didn't get a good checkup for the neck up in this morning. I'm not saying that I am going to be doing a checkup from the neck up every single day, but it is something that I enjoy doing and I like to share with you guys, okay? So, as you all guys know, I have on purple. Um, the title of this video will probably be Purple Passion Plus Appreciation Slash um, Earring Haul here. I have on a purple um, shirt and it has like a little design on it. Kind of reminds me of something that's like retro mid 80s or whatever with the little poof kind of sleeves on it. I really love it. All right. I'm also wearing a very um, thick purple chain that's like the fuchsia one in my uh, fuchsia's bag video. This is the purple one. And I also have on the very thick gold chain. Guys, combining your jewelry is the key to creating selective, unique pieces that everyone will compliment you on, okay? If you got a lot of jewelry, don't be afraid to mix and match and clash some of this stuff together. It will create a very nice look and a very unique style. People will not be able to go to the store and get what you have because you will be taking pieces that you already have and merging them together. Okay, I do this all the time. Um, I absolutely love matching my accessories up. Okay, so you want to start off by getting pieces that will go with anything. Like this big thick gold chain, it will go with any necklace that I want to put on with it. This is not, um, the, it's not really like the chain that I wore in my video, um, Leopard is My Lover. 
it is a different kind of more acrylic type chain. Um, the chain that came with the Leopard is My Lover was more of a heavier chain, okay? So again, that is that, okay? So are you loving the pieces? All right, I'm trying to make this video as quick as possible due to uploading purposes. I don't wanna spend like 30 minutes uploading a video. My wrist arm candy, if you can see that, I have on my purple outline zigzag ring, okay? My wrist is outlined with the chunky gold stone bangles that are a set of my favorite. And I have on this huge block um, bangle. Let me just take this off so you guys can see it. It is very, very big, like Flintstone type bangle. I have a couple of these and I absolutely love them. They've been in my collection for quite a while. You'll probably see them featured in the bangle collection that's later to come. So overall, taking a step back, this is my look, okay? I know that um might seem a little bit all over the place, but anyways, we're gonna roll with it. So moving on, okay? I went to the beauty supply store yesterday, not even looking for any jewelry. The name of the beauty supply store is YT Beauty, located here in Atlanta, Georgia. I purchased, they gave me a box, okay? This lady actually had a box of earrings for me that she said, because I make my trips in there weekly, that she knew that I was going to want. So she boxed them up for me, okay? It just came in like another little jewelry box or whatever the case is, but she put them in here for me. I'm sure something else may have came in this box. Okay, let me show you before I actually go through these what the earrings actually look like, okay? I have some earrings similar to these. They're more like diamond studded that I um, just got done wearing um, when I did my video featuring my mother with her outfit of the day, okay? They are these. They are the humongous um, square earrings, but they actually come with a shiny, more like metallic -y surface. I love these. And when she showed them to me, I almost had a heart attack okay i got several colors and i wanted to take these out to show you guys uh because i'm not going to be taking the other ones out of the boxes um or out of the paper that they come in or whatever but these are the back of them they are jet black guys again with these earrings i love them how big they look but the thing about them is the back is black so if they flip you kind of have to keep on adjusting them they do work better with longer hair because they just kind of dangle from your ear. But um, I completely love these, okay? So now that I've took those out to show you, I'm just gonna hold these up. They did come in like a little bit of um, like, you know, clear baggy to leave them laying flat until you're ready to wear them. Me, I probably will be returning these to the baggy because uh, the little bag, I'm saying baggy like a preschooler. <laughs> But the bag, I'm going to keep them in the bag because these type of earrings, if you don't hang them up on a wall, it'll be easy to smush them or actually get them um, all messed up or whatever. So moving into what's in the box, these are the colors. Okay. This is the black pair. The solid black. She gave me a green pair. Okay. Probably have to do this with a with a um, green inspired uh, eyeshadow look. I've got a rainbow pair, okay? Again, my makeup, my eyeshadow look will probably end up being rainbow when I wear these, okay? I'm trying to decide if this is more of a burnt orange color or if this is more like a red. I'm gonna lean more towards a bur burnt orange color. So she gave me those. Okay, I've got a really pretty, pretty aqua blue. I just know that's gonna be hidden when I wear that. I'm gonna tear that up because the turquoise is one of my favorite colors, guys. So if you ever, ever send me anything, any type of accessory, if you have turquoise in it or whatever the case is, if I get a gift from anybody in my family, they know pink and turquoise are my colors. Okay, you guys know that I love this fuchsia metallic color. 
Now this looks kind of similar to the burnt orange on camera, but let me do the comparison. They are not the same. As you can see, that's a little bit more orangey. This is fuchsia. And um, because I'm me, I asked her that she have a second pair of black. Because that's my thing. When I get something that's a favorite, I always try to get um, like an extra black or an extra silver. Because I'm assuming when all else fails, you got to have your black. So um, I do have a second pair of black. I don't know, I may choose to give them away when I do like a giveaway or something, but you can never go wrong having too much black or too much silver or gold, okay? Especially when it's an earring that I like, and if the black tears up, it's almost like, oh God. Because you know you just wear black with everything, right? So yeah, these are the blacks. So I am just going to um, put these back in the box or whatever. These were very, very, very reasonably priced. She typically would sell these um, for $2 a piece. She gave the whole box to me for five, simply because I come in there all the time. And like I said, she had this waiting on me behind the counter. That's how known I am with the accessories, okay? Packaged and ready to go, okay? So, um, and she knows I always send people to her as well. So, thank you so much, Miss um, Miss K. Chesky. Okay, she's, y'all, she's, she's Japanese, so, I mean, Kacheski, somebody. Anyways, thank you so much. I don't anticipate she's watching this video, but I really love the earrings, okay? So, yeah, guys, this video is about 11 and some change, so I am going to go ahead and say bye. Um, until the next time, thank you so much for subscribing. Thank you so much for viewing the haul. Um, thank you so much for letting me do my outfit of the days. And I want to say, until the next time, stay brisk, stay breeze, stay superior from the supremacy, baby. Bye.